name's Andy Hillier and today I'm checking out this new guitar amplifier from Blackstar. It's called the St. James. It's a new range of amplifiers. There's two variants of the St. James. You've got uh, different power amp valves in each one. You've got the 6L6, which is 6L6 um, power amp valves, and then the amplifier that I've got here today, which is the EL34. Now they're both voiced slightly differently. The 6L6 is more of a modern high gain kind of sound. Whereas the EL34 that I've got here, that's a more kind of uh, traditional rock, crunchy blues kind of amplifier. Each variant is available as a 1x12 combo or a head with matching 2x12 cabinet. And these are crazy light. The, the 1x12 combo is 12.8 kilos, which is crazy light. Uh, the head is 6.7 kilos and the cabinet is 13.7 kilos. So they're crazy light for a, a valve amplifier. Apparently they're the lightest 50 watt all valve amplifiers. Okay, so let's go on to the features. So it's a 50 watt amplifier um, that can be adjusted down to two watts and the two watt sounds great. It, it, sometimes on amplifiers you turn it to two watts and you lose a lot of the tone, but this just sounds great just at a lower volume. <laughs> channel amplifier so you've got a clean channel and a distorted channel uh, built-in reverb the lovely thing about the reverb is it sounds different uh, on the different channels so on the clean channel it's slightly bigger reverb on the distorted channel it's slightly smaller which works perfectly uh, with those channels there's also a three band EQ a volume for the clean channel and then a separate volume and gain for the distorted channel and then there's a master volume to control the master volume on the distortion channel, we've also got a, a separate foot switchable 10 dB boost, which boosts into the front of the preamp, gives you more like a saturation, slightly warmer, creamier kind of distortion sound. The amplifier has got a built-in reactive load, which means you can record the guitar amp silently. It's got a cab sim built-in that has got three different um, cabs already pre-built into the amplifier but they can be completely adjusted and you can put your own cab sims, whatever you want, via the software on the computer. So you can record out completely silently, you just put it onto standby, and there's an XLR out, record straight into the computer and record that way. Well, that's enough talk. Let's have a listen, see what it sounds like. I've plugged my guitar direct into the amplifier. Uh, I've got a room mic and then also I've plugged the XLR straight into my computer. So you'll be able to hear what the cab sims sound like. Uh, okay, let's start off. This is the EQ all set to 12 o'clock. No reverb, it's just a clean channel, and we get this. <laughs> And just so we can hear the reverb, let's crank it all the way up. Now this amplifier's got a really nice EQ. I love it when you put an amp up and set everything to 12 o'clock and it sounds great, which it does. Then if you add a bit of treble, it's really effective. It doesn't sound harsh, but it just brightens up.
put the treble back and let's put the mid range, we'll put that up. <laughs> Put the mid range back down and put the bass up a little bit. So no settings on it sound like bad. Sometimes when you adjust EQs on amps, they just sound really harsh, but it's a really musical EQ. It sounds great. Okay, so let's jump over to the distorted channel. We're now on channel two and we've got the gain at 12 o'clock. Try turning the gain down to about three o'clock. Let's turn the gain up to about three o'clock. the gain all the way up. While we've got the gain cranked, let's engage the 10 dB boost. So let's hear what it sounds uh, DI'd, straight into my DAW. Uh, so we've got the, the cab sim on here, we've got three different cabs pre-built in, let's have a listen to the different ones. <laughs> So my thoughts on the St. James by Black Star. Uh, first off, I think it's really well built. Um, it looks really nice. It looks really premium. I love this uh, illuminated Black Star logo on it. It looks really, really cool. The lightness is crazy. So if you're a gigging guitarist and you want an amp that's really easy to take around, uh, it's perfect. It's plenty loud enough for gigs. 50 watt all valve amp. It's gonna be plenty loud enough for pretty much most situations. Uh, I think it sounds great. I love the clean channel. I love the distorted channel. Um, for classic kind of rock stuff and blues, it sounds spot on. The inclusion of the uh, reactive load and the cab sim is fantastic. For a recording, it's, it's, it's just really, really useful. Really easy to use, exactly what you want. Just two channels, EQ sounds great. The reverb sounds stunning. Uh, I just think it sounds great. Really worth checking out this amplifier. Well, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hopefully you've enjoyed this little demo. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video. Leave me some comments in the comment section as well. Well, thanks for watching this. I've been Andy Hillier and I'll see you next time.